Interesting. Yeah, and Jan Bertongen obviously is one of the players that you've talked about during the summer. Obviously, Ericsson that was a little bit, you know, whether they would stay, whether they would go. It's a little bit of a watershed moment, possibly, isn't it, for Tottenham? You know, yeah. with that thing that's hanging over the club at the moment. Yeah, and that's unsettling for all yeah. the players. I think it'll be unsettling for the manager. I think you can see that in the manager's tone in mm. his press conferences yeah. and it's, it's unsettled them a little bit. So it's, it's for players, they want to see, see stability. Mm. New players coming into a change room that inspire others. Yeah. And that hasn't happened for yeah. a number of years now. They, they reached, obviously, the Champions League final. Um, but it's that old thing about you start to need to win things. And if you don't win things, are you going to keep your big players? Well, I, I don't think so, and I, it leads me to, to look at Harry Kane, yeah. for example. Like, and he asks you the question, what are you in the game for? Are you in the game for staying at one club and being a one-club man and being a legend at, at that club, or are you in it to win trophies? Yeah. Now, you ask yourself the next question, do Spurs look like a team capable of winning trophies? Do they? I don't think so, no. no. I think they, they were a better so team if, probably so a couple of years ago. So if you were Harry Kane, well, you were in a similar situation at points in your career. West Ham, Leeds as well. When well, you Leeds went to is a very similar ex example yeah. as to where I was, a similar time in, in his career. Probably I was a year or two younger, but I was in a team, Champions League semi-final, nearly, all, mm. nearly team to win a league, yeah. maybe have a chance potentially. But you felt you were a nearly but, uh, club. Possibly. Exactly, and I thought I, I've got a better chance elsewhere and I had the opportunity yeah. to go. And that was Manchester United and I made a very quick decision. Mm. I want to go and win trophies yeah. because my career would be based in my own mind on winning trophies. And, then, and I think Harry Kane's probably thinking about or having them questions in his mind mm. and they need answering, I think, soon because he's 26 yeah. now. Mm. and. You only get a window of opportunity, and there's something they come and they go very quickly. If, if Spurs stay like they are, mm. uh, Peter, just kind of that nearly winning things, if you were Harry Kane, what would you do? Uh, that's a difficult one. I'm probably the wrong man to ask, having moved clubs about 12 <laughs> times. But, um, <laughs> well, you're probably the right man to ask. Uh, yeah, maybe. But uh, <laughs> listen, I, I think there's a lot to be said about being a legend at a football club. Yeah. And I think, uh, yeah, he can move on and go and win trophies, but. Mm. To come back in here to, to this stadium in, in 20, 30 years. There's no time, better stadium to play in at the moment his, in Europe. With his kids, having been, you know, he's not far, yeah. far off being the record goal scorer yeah. at, at a club like Tottenham Hotspur. He's not a far, far off being. A records, Greece, personal right? records are more important than trophies? No, though? listen, I think uh, this, yeah. trophies, he'll want to win trophies. Yeah. And I think he's at that transitional period. He'll want now, to right? win them, of course, at Tottenham. Of course, but yeah. they are. They are not there at the moment no. and I think he'll want signings he'll want some, some assurances that he can do it at this football club or, or he will leave and, and, and where could he leave and, and I suppose it depends on what sort of person he is Owen. I think the only reason Harry Kane leaves Tottenham Hotspur is for Real Madrid that's it like Cristiano Ronaldo left Manchester United and nobody begrudged yeah. him because it was or Barcelona could I add those yeah, those are the only yeah, yeah. two. Otherwise, I don't see him leaving uh, Tottenham Hotspur. I hope he stays for a very long time. I think Tottenham can win things, but they're just they're behind a you know a dominant yeah. Manchester City and yeah, the team. See, he's got to see a difference in what we've seen in the last three or four years. He's got to see that. Really, they got to the Champions League final season. last year. Yeah, he got to the Champions League final. But what happens? No real investment in the squad. Does he, did, did Harry Kane walk in this pre-season and go, wow? I'm loving seeing this guy next to me. This is what I, this yeah. is what I needed. This is what I've needed. I think you're liking Dombele and Los Celso, but they've been injured. They haven't played. They're not inspiring. They're no disrespect. Yeah. They're, they're talented players, and I think Dombele is going to be a top player. But that's not instantly going to him as a 26-year-old. And you this can see that the manager the as league. well is slightly disgruntled about the situation. Yeah. Would, it, would it suggest to you, in any way, shape, or form, if he if he's quite happy with his lot, that he lacks a little bit of ambition? I don't know, it's just maybe the type of person he is. Yeah. You could say he lacks ambition or what, but he might just be a type of person. He wants a home buddy, he wants to stay at home with his family and friends, and he loves Spurs. If yeah. that's the case, that's, so be it, that's him. Mm. That's just the way he was. I'm looking at it from, I used to think about when I finish, I want to be able to sit back and look yeah. on trophies that I've won, not on personal, I've been top goal scorer, or where's your trophies? The, the, the difference to win something here with Spurs, to mm. win two or three La Ligas at Real Madrid, yeah. one, one trophy here with Spurs will mean a hell of a lot more to him than, I agree. than a couple of La, yeah. La Ligas. Yeah, but he's, he's probably sitting there thinking now, watching his manager in the press conferences and going, he might be gone now. He looks, he looks so unhappy. It's a different Pochettino to we saw last year, I, the year before, yeah. year before that. So if he goes, where will I we suppose it then? largely depends on, on where Tottenham goes, which is why I think it's possibly a seminal moment for the club. Huge it is, moment. and Huge. that's the point. I think by November, end of November, they'll yeah. be third. Yeah. And they'll be behind the, t the two great teams oh. in this league, Manchester City and or Liverpool. Fourth. They forgot Leicester. <laughs> <laughs> Could be. They're, I mean, they are They're pretty good bad. to be fair. Are we 10 or 15 points? But the point is, yeah. no, Manchester City and Liverpool have had uh, consistent investment in the squad mm. three, four years. Tottenham have just had one now. So I think if 
in two years' time, if they're not there at Tottenham, of course, then he can go to Real Madrid and he's 28. But I think at what they have infrastructure-wise, stadium, never. training ground, they have mm. everything in place yeah. to be one of the great teams in this in country. In two years, Mbappe's at Real Madrid, Harry can't go there. Yeah, no, I'll get that. That's what I'm talking, I, know, I know what you mean, yeah. But that's a choice he has to make. But I think in two years' time, if they've had four windows and they haven't invested yeah. 400 million and that gap is, hasn't shrunk, then it's time to leave. His I think right now it's there. His head will be turned now, because especially mm. with the run he's in dressing room with Ericsson, Vertonghen, and these mm. people not signing contracts. It will be turned without a doubt at this and point. And as well, we were talking earlier in the Willy Vago, Carl Walker's gone. He'd be speaking to him on the phone at times or seeing that and going, wow, he's got two league trophies. Danny two Rose two is here. League Danny league Rose league. is here. He's in the same position a few years back as Carl Walker. Carl Walker's now got a Premier League yeah. title and he's on probably the double the money's on. Exactly. Mm. Do players talk about money still amongst themselves? They don't need to. There's enough spoken in the media, yeah. but they talk about trophies. But it's minutes. not about money, is it, for no. nowadays? Because they all have plenty at this level. So it's, a, it's, a, it's about winning things or... Yeah, definitely. Yeah. But, I mean, they, there's, a lot to, there's a lot of teams out there, yeah. lots to take in, and, you know, they'll want trophies. And Harry Kane's no different. Yeah.